What's up, everybody? What's going on? I hope all of y'all are doing undeniably fan freaking tastic out there. It's Monday, and you know what that means. It's vlog day once again. I hope all of y'all had a good week. Hope all of y'all had a good Monday so far. This week has been pretty alright, can't complain. I started my new job this past Tuesday, and to sum up what I'm doing in my job so far, throughout this first week, I've been working with the produce department of a local grocery store. So far, in this first week, I've mainly been chopping up vegetables. Chopping up bell peppers, zucchini, squash, um, cut up some pineapple, and I've been learning how to stock the food in the right places. So, I do have a new job and that's what I'm doing for now. The more I work there, the more likely I'm going to be getting a new position and start getting some more hours in. But the important thing is, I do have a job now. So, that's good. But, um, the reason why I'm not holding the championship in this vlog is because I don't want to spoil the outcome of it. <clears throat> Real quick, I need to give a special shout out to my friend Brad. And Brad, he's been working with Action Pack Wrestling as of late. And this dude is a technical wizard. Alright, Brad, he, um, he has helped revamp and reshape APW's image. Okay. He has helped make the technical stuff even better. Now because of him, we have entrance videos once again, and he's really stepped up the game as far as social media goes. And now our attendance levels here at Action Pack Wrestling, it's been amazing. Like for the past two shows, we've been up over 100 fans in attendance. And both nights, they, they have the audience reactions and the energy. It has been incredible to say the least. So this past Friday, I was defending the championship against Jax Insane. And I was supposed to have a match with Jax the night I had the match with Kid Riot, but something came up. And I finally was able to have the match with Jax this past Friday. And I don't want to spoil the results of that match until I upload it this coming Friday. Okie dokie. Alright. So anyway, folks. Um, make sure y'all tune in Friday for uh, that, that match. But I do have some other uploads ready to go up this week. I do. Tomorrow there will be another episode of the Multiverse Mayhem. Wednesday might be an episode of My Dear Letters. Maybe. Uh, Thursday, St. Patrick's Day, going to be uploading an episode of OSG, the old school game. And for those of you that didn't hear what I said last week, um, I feel like I am an irresponsible YouTuber. Because somehow or another, I accidentally deleted what was supposed to be an entire episode of Dr. Muto. Like, ever since I started playing that game with the series, like, it, it felt like I was just like running, like running into one issue after another, and I haven't been able to record every single piece of progress that I made with that game. That game is just like so complicated and so unorganized. And I, I, at this point, I'm just ready to get through the game and finish up the story for it. Because I've been waiting over a decade to finish that game. So, any pro at this point, any progress is better than none at all, really. Um, Friday, going to be up on the Master Jackson saying, you know that. Saturday, if it's possible, I'm going to be trying to go back and film another match at America Pro Wrestling. I'm not sure who I'm having a match with then there yet. But I'm gonna have the ha I'm gonna try to get that footage ready by Sunday, maybe, because Sunday I have some other plans, but I gotta I gotta take a look at that in a minute. But Saturday, 
Alright, Saturday now. Um, Saturday, I'm going to be seeing if I can upload a trailer of the announcements about what's going to be happening with this year's Week Mania schedule. I have a lot of good stuff in mind and hope all of you will enjoy it as well. I wish I could go ahead and say what the schedule is now, but I don't know everything date by date. I should have wrote that stuff down. I apologize. Y'all just gonna have to tune in Saturday to find out what's up. And look, as far as as far as what my schedule is looking like for live streaming now with this new job, I don't even know yet. At this point, all I can say is when it comes to scheduling a stream, you're just going to have to tune in to find out. The week of, possibly. So, with that being said, if I had to guess, if I really, really, really had to guess, I'm going to see, I'm, I'm going to see if I can live stream on Thursday the 24th Thursday the 24th let's see if I can do 5 p.m. okay 5 p.m. I'm gonna talk to Queen Enterprises and see what's good there Queen Enterprises if you're out there watching there's your shout out love you baby so yeah on to some other notes, um, I need to send out some prayer requests right quick to Scott Hall, Ray's Ramon. Shortly after I got back from church, I logged onto Facebook and I read this and it said, Scott Hall has been hospitalized after suffering three heart attacks last night. He is on life support and said to be in critical condition. So, Razor Ramon, Scott Hall, please get well soon. I'm, I'm praying for you. Please don't let this be the end of the bad guy. Love you. Love you, Razor. Love you, Scott. Get well soon, buddy. So... Yeah, um, moving on, I have a review right quick. This past Saturday, I went on my first church trip with Woodard since I moved. I, since I came back, I've really missed my church, and I've been able to be blessed to go on with another trip with them, okay? This past Saturday, we went to a... We went to a production called Narrowway. Well, it was Narrowway Productions. And to my understanding, Narrowway Productions is a Christian-based play production company, pretty much. And I went to go take a look at their pre presentation, if that's the right word for it, of The Fourth Cross. And... Without giving too much away, it like really put the story of Barabbas into perspective. And Barabbas is the part that I'm playing for my church's Easter drum coming up. On April 8th till the 11th. Same play, three different nights. But watching that play, it was just extraordinary. You know, um, it, it's one thing. When it comes to the story of Jesus' crucifixion, right, it's one thing to hear the stories and read the story over and over again. It's another thing to see different depictions of it through different types of media, whether it be movies, videos, or pictures even. But to see it reenacted live, the way that they presented it, it, it was just an astonishing experience. That, that's the best way that I can put it. Like, the effort that, the effort that Neroway put into the production of this play, it was just superb. So, 
I, I tip my hat to them, and I can't wait to go back one of these days. So, yeah. Other than that, um, I don't have much else to vlog about. Except, oh yeah, this coming Friday the 18th, that's my brother's birthday, so happy birthday, Josh. So, uh, yeah, um, don't really have much updates, really. Other than that, I do have some work days this week, but I know I'm off Wednesday, I believe. So, and I, and I think I'm off Friday. I think I'm off Friday, too, which is good. So, all right. All right, I think I can go and wrap up the vlog here. And, uh, yeah, until next time, make sure all of you stay tuned to SSP. And yeah, I hope all of you can remain to continue being outrageously optimistic year-round. Booyah. I love you all. And here comes my hug of appreciation. Bye. Love you.